Uh, but like you say, yeah, I can kind of see like Lemons like stopping, stopping like some short approaches, and and him being just a terror on the ledge, being making it scary for Cloud to just recover in general. So I mean, just approaching horizontally with Cloud is really hard in this matchup. Yeah, uh, Lemons just stuff out pretty much everything. either stuff or like it just clanks and resets neutral. Like mm. okay. All right, 25% off of that one exchange. It's kind of crazy. Lemons, let's see, let's see, let's see. Miss grab, and then no one capitalized on it, but right there, nice little metal blade into some lemons. Just some safe pressure right now. He's playing pretty slow. So this is one of the matchups that Mega Man has to face especially carefully because uh, Nair, like, Nair back air has such long range horizontally. Yeah. So even if he doesn't find himself, like, spacing lemons right, he could get hit by a lot of aerials, and you can yeah. see that right now. Ooh. Ooh. That, that was B. cute. Yeah, it was kind of cute. B, I haven't seen that since he came out, <laughs> since since Cloud came out for DLC. The B reverse. Uh, nah, I remember beam. GDX and True Shark used to do that when they came, when they yeah. came out. They were like, "Oh, this is great because it does cover the whole ledge." And if you're not ready to tech, I don't even I don't even know if you could tech, but good stuff by him. And right now he's trying to lap him in percent. Uh, Hero's got to find his way back to stage and not jump back like that. Now he doesn't have a jump. Yeah. I don't know, just jumping with me, and like almost jumping with anyone against Cloud is really scary. Because you lose that jump and then you're just going to eat 50% or die. I'm, <laughs> so. just talk, I'm just talking about jumping in general. Like, yeah. he's got so much good <laughs> vertical hitboxes. Yeah, right? It's There's just, always a hitbox. Like, you just jump, you get smacked in the forehead. You're like, oh, he went for it again. He learned. Yeah, all right. And he was just waiting. Wow. Wasn't ready for him to just run off that platform and hit him with a hot there. Oh, that was not a. That was too quick of a game. It was too Body quick. But like you were saying, like it was very scary for um Hero to just jump. Every single time he jumped forward, <laughs> it seemed like every time he jumped forward, it seemed like he just got hit by a nair, a bear, or even a fair at times. And then even if he like jumped back and retreated, he would get met by a dash attack or a grab or something like that. So he's got to find a way to, to get some damage to get things started, you know? I don't know, like, what are Mega Man's good out of shield options? Because I feel like jumping outside of like having Metal Blade and maybe like footstooling him. Uh, besides grabbing uh, in this matchup, I can't really see him doing anything else besides, like... Because I feel like just sitting in shields a lot better than a lot of these short hops he's doing uh, a yo, lot yo. of the time. Yeah, I, I think just, like, trying to do something un like unsafe like that is just going to get you, like, much more damage. And now I got the Dwayne thing, making it on commentary. That's good. Oh, that hero's actually in the street right now? Yeah, yeah, he is. In a while. Right? I feel like it has been, but oh man, how is this? Okay, game this two. game two. The first game was not good. Uh, he only put like 65 on uh, you walk. I, I remember this was actually one of the matchups that Hero kept saying actually wasn't terrible for Mega Man, and I'm kind of inclined to believe on it. I feel like uh, pellets are should be a little bit annoying for Cloud to deal with, but obviously mm. that that can still happen. <laughs> yeah, that still happens regardless. I don't care if you have lemons, limes. I don't care what you got. That's gonna work. <laughs> back air is always going to work as well. So, like, oh, yeah. good stuff at Evac taking that uh, stock with only 65% on him. But, yeah, like, Lemons could be a problem, but, like, he yeah, hasn't really been spacing himself correctly, and he's been getting eaten by, like, aerials. So, like, it's, it hasn't been looking too good. Okay, no, that makes sense. I feel like it's going to be the main way that Cloud's going to capitalize. Yeah. Like, the way that Mega Man has to pressure is, like, it's so specific. Oh, that's a, that's a huge opportunity right yeah. there. Lemon, 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 Lemon. No, he oh, went. He God! Ah, <laughs> I get so triggered when they go for that. Hey, they go big yeah. or go home. Yeah. I mean, there's certain. Like, normally it kind of makes sense to do it against Cloud, uh, but the thing is, like, he can actually just kind of. He can sort of mix up what nice his tech. body's going to be, and he has a fairly good horizontal magnet hands. Vertical wise, not as much. <laughs> With that grab to grab, I love it. I actually killed that 122, though. Yeah. That's His grab is good. I, I don't know what that the DI. Probably not that strong. Yeah, I was about to say, uh, I don't know about the DI. Really I don't know about the DI, yeah, but we take those. Yeah. <laughs> we definitely take those. And right now, he's playing a little bit more confident. It, his game hasn't been looking like the most like clean, you know? It looks He looks very hesitant. looks kind of scared, you know? But he's finding himself right now. Yeah, right now it looks like he's slowed down a little bit. He's thinking about his position a little bit more. I think he can... Ooh, wow, that's such a big drop from the walk there. Hero actually not resetting his pressure by not trying to jump out of that uh, Lemons. Yeah. Mm, another back air. He's got to be careful with this. Oh, nice. That was nice a good jump. Ah. I do not like... Oh, he's trying to turn around and... <laughs> turn around and Lemon again? I don't like that option. No, I mean, no, no. He, what he did was he landed with up air, and then he just did up the outer shield. Uh, to punish the no, no, I mean, uh, what was Hero trying to do? No, do Hero, Hero fell down with up air. Oh, like okay. He's thinking of doing the like you know the normal thing you just land with that yeah, land with that, yeah. pressure yeah uh, uh, it's just that at that moment that was just 
Not the right idea. No, 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 no. Yeah. Especially not with the at limit. Yeah. Oh, we got Wonderbird and Goblin. I didn't even know he was here. I didn't know either. I mean, we do have some of the Puerto Rican players yeah. here, as far as I know. We have, we have Pennsylvania here, too. Wait, pretty, what? Yeah, yeah, the same ones that came uh, CEO or whatever. Oh. So I guess they have some family in town or whatever. I don't really know. Yeah. I don't really know how that works. But they, <laughs> they're they could here. also be escaping the Pennsylvania weather right now. You're right. They're like, uh, <laughs> they come down here. They're like, all right, good. I, I like this. 80, yeah. 70. That's that could that could that could work. That could work. That's true. That's true. And um, this is gonna be interesting because we had Goblin Man uh, early on stream. He went against Bolshak. Uh, he won that game three. He kind of dominated game three as well. I can see that. So yeah. um, yeah, he just kind of steamroll. You know how like Goblin Man goes. Like his pressure, he just starts hitting them buttons, and, he, yep. and he's he's getting in like a, a train. So Bullshack? I want to see if that's the same thing with this. It's going to be different. I mean, Bullshack is a player. I've seen him crumble quite a lot, actually. Mm. Like, uh, d definitely when he gets thrown off, he gets pressured. He's just so like a player weakness. He just yeah. kind of, like, falls. Yeah, yeah, no, that's definitely one thing. He has some really good highs, but, like, I would say his his norm, his norm average game, he can get thrown off pretty easily. Okay. So, Wonder Bread, obviously not, not a player that Yeah, really not that. Much. Yeah, I haven't really seen Wonder Bread, like, crumble like that or fall apart. Nah, so, this is going to be very interesting. I want to see, game. like, I would love to see Goblin Man, because Goblin Man always tries to force his game on anyone he plays, regardless of who you are, regardless of PR, regardless of whatever. PGR, yeah. PR, it doesn't really matter. He's going to try to force his game. Um, I would love to see if he can if he can manage that versus uh, someone of Wonder Bread's caliber, you know? The main issue, the main question I have is I just wonder who Wonder Bread's going to play because he's been yeah. doing a lot he's more Lucina. Lucina, right? Yeah. Yeah, so I don't know if we'll see Mac um, now. Not sure. Me personally, if I was like a, a Mac and a Lucina co-main or whatever, I would, I would love to go low Mac, but like... Yeah, a little Mac for Roy seems fine to me. It seems kind of fun. <laughs> it yeah. seems like I could just hit, like, I get hit him with a whole lot of crap. <laughs> but um, I, Lucina works too. I mean, I'm pretty sure it's like 55, 45 Lucina anyways because of her no, it's just a, choice it, and stuff it like that. Yeah, so like, for sure. <laughs> it, it, that's definitely good. But I would love to see little Mac versus uh, Roy. I think that's like yeah. a, a, a hard hitting match, a hard that's hit just, of setup. That's just no matter what, people are just going to die. Yeah, it's people like, are dying pretty fun to, to F smash. Someone's yeah. F smash. Someone's F tilt. I, I don't know. I would love to see who he goes with. Because I do know he has a Lucina. You already know what Goblin Man's going with. Okay, okay, so we're going to start. We're at least starting off with Lucina. Yeah. 